about us. You just gave me an idea. So sad, isn't it? Eric and Nicole are supposed to be spending their first wedding anniversary together and they've spent more time apart than they have together. I know that this has been so hard on Nicole. Yeah, even harder than you think. What does that mean? Nothing, nothing. I just, I just hope to God my brother realizes that he has to put his marriage first. Otherwise, he might end up losing Nicole for good. Wow, so you come back to town and you don't even tell me. I'm telling you now, and I'm also telling you because I want you to know that Nicole and I are going to have a little surprise party and we're inviting a few friends. I'm texting everybody, but I wanted to call you myself. Because it wouldn't be a party without me? Because I want you to be nothing but happy and supportive for me and Nicole. Otherwise, we don't want you to come. We don't. Or you mean she doesn't? I want what Nicole wants. Can I count on you, Sammy? Eric, you can always count on me. Oh, you lying slut. <laughs> you are going to pay for this. Lucas will have to accept the fact that I'm back for good now. And Samantha and I have reconnected in every way. Hmm. Well, I am so happy for you, EJ. And for Sammy, of course. Thank you. Thank you. And I'm sorry if Lucas is hurt, but the love that Samantha and I share is once in a lifetime. And we're together again, and more solid than ever before. What if EJ sees the letter, but Sammy has no idea that it ever came from you? All right, talk to me. I'm listening. If you want to get Sammy back, you got to fight dirty. you got to fight like EJ does. you got to get that letter in his hands. He'll blow up their marriage, reclaim the woman that you love. Just make sure that it can never be traced back to you. Where is Xander? He's not here. What? Well, where is he? He's uh, at the police station. What? Why? He's been arrested. Oh, I demand to see a lawyer. This is obviously police brutality. It's outrage. If you didn't want to be arrested, then you shouldn't have shot me. You provoked me. Just for my job. All right, Xander, this is how this is going to go. You're going to sit there and you're going to chill out until you're ready to tell me everything that you know about the death of Dr. Clay Snyder. Understood? I don't believe it. What? <laughs> Eric is in town. He's in town. He, he wants to have a wedding anniversary party at the pub. Wow, that's amazing news. When? Now. You want to come with me? That is the last text. Mm -hmm. Are you hungry? Definitely, but not for yogurt. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I really wouldn't mind second. But we haven't parted yet. Oh. You know, you really didn't have to go through all that trouble. Well, I think you deserve a blowout party celebration. <laughs> Just wish it could have been more. But my dad is making your favorite cheese balls. Well, you know, I can't resist a good cheese ball. Mm. I'm just so glad I have you home.